if you're a high school senior like me, first of all, congratulations if you have graduated. And if you decided to go to college at these next four years or two years, wherever your case may be, you may or may not have checked out maybe the college apparel your school may have and realize it's so expensive and you don't actually have the money for it and it costs way too much for a piece of fabric. Like, it really makes no sense. I got you covered, kids. So as you can tell from the title, I will be doing a DIY. I haven't done a DIY in forever and I'm sorry for everyone that has been waiting to see a DIY. My ideas, it's like gone. I, I don't know why. But here I am today and I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your own college apparel. Okay, I haven't done this in a while, but the first thing you're going to need is a crew neck or a sweater of some kind. I got mine from Amazon and uh, you're also going to need some iron on letters in the colors of your college. Also from Amazon, you're going to need a needle and some embroidery thread you can get that literally at Walmart and that is basically everything you're gonna need so the first thing I did was iron on the letters I just took my time to arrange it the way I want it to look like and once you're done with that take a pillowcase of some kind and just put that down and then iron over it you don't want to iron it directly to the iron on letters I just found this on the directions of my letters and I just pressed that down for 30 seconds each on both letters on either side and this is what it ended up looking like it's already looking pretty good um and then what I went ahead and did was take an embroidery hoop this is a little optional but it's just easier to embroider over the crew neck and then you're gonna take some embroidery thread I recommend white and then you're gonna just do a double knot on either side um, to secure the needle and what you're just gonna do is just do like an up and down stitch I really don't know what the term of it is but it just makes it look like there's dash lines on the edge of each letter and a technique is to just poke it through down and then quickly go back up and just pull it through so you don't have to go up and down the sweater if that makes any sense um, just watching the video will probably make more sense than what I'm saying um, but once that's done I recommend to do a knot for each letter so that it's not like so tangled on the back of the crew neck and just do like a double knot there's no specific way to do it but this is what both letters look like and just like that you're just gonna do the same thing on the other letters depending on how long your college is and once that's done it should look something like this and oh my gosh just doing this makes it look so much cuter I mean if you want you can just stop here but what I ended up doing was sketching a design of what I wanted to add to the crew neck and I thought of doing like sunflowers because that's the yellow and green of the letters of my college. Let's say your school colors is red, you can use like a cherry or let's say it's blue, you can do like a, a dolphin. I don't know, something really cute like that. As you can see, I'm just kind of playing around with what I wanted to do and I ended up deciding on like a small bunch of um, sunflowers on the bottom and so once that was done, I just took a white pen and I just drew a sketch of what I wanted to embroider and I found this photo off of Pinterest, I think, and this is what it kind of looked like before I embroidered my design. And so once that's done, I took my embroidery hoop again because it's just so much easier to embroider. This is like really cheap, guys. You can go on Amazon. Um, and I just started embroidering my sunflowers with yellow and green embroidery thread. Now I'm not an expert or anything but I've embroidered like four things and so this was not that hard for me to do but anyone can really embroider guys. It's kind of like coloring or painting but like with string. <laughs> so I just went up and down you know with the colors of my embroidery thread uh, that I want to use and I just filled in the image I drew on the crew neck. Um, again, there's no right or wrong way of doing this, just have patience, I guess. Um, it is very, very tedious, but once it's done, guys, it's so worth it. I'm so pleased with what it turned out looking like and this is what my finished crew neck looks like. And guys, I'm obsessed. Like, I might as well wear this every day and when I go to bed. So don't be surprised if I wear this in every video. <laughs> guys. I love how my crew neck turned out. I haven't seen anything cuter than this and I could be very biased to something I made, but it's like a twist to a basic jacket or crew neck that some college would have, but for a portion, a portion of the price. And you might be wondering, this is a little plain, like how can one style something like this? I got you. I'm gonna be showing you guys some outfit ideas you can use to wear your crew neck. 
So with this first outfit, I just took a flannel and I put that under the crew neck and make sure the collar was popping out and the sleeves and it just made it look so cute and I added the jeans with it and some black fans and it's just a comfortable, you know, everyday outfit you can use in college. Ah, oh, that's so weird to say. But yeah, this is the first outfit. Outfit number two is a little bit more laid back and just put some sweats under it and I just use um, my white fans with this outfit and it just looks like a little bit more comfy. Just have a bun on and just have this be like the statement. And lastly, for a formal look, I just took the crew neck and tucked that into a simple denim skirt and just wore some simple vans and uh, just made sure to puff that out a little bit in the front and I wore a little bandana to dress things up a little bit. That's the finished look and I honestly love this one the most. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope this video inspired you to make something yourself and to be unique with your own college apparel. This is a really fun project. I feel like anyone can do. It's super easy and I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel to see more videos coming soon and I'll see you guys in my next one. Stay safe everyone. Bye!